Hey guys, Tech Made Easy, and thank you so much for clicking on our video today. Well, we've got a cool case for you that Samsung made. It's actually called the standing cover. And the cool thing about this cover is you can have an S Pen inside of it, or you can have a kickstand. It actually has a slot that's made for it. Obviously, this is for the Fold 4. We picked that up in blue, and we're going to go ahead and show you this case. We're going to test wireless charging. We're going to test wireless power share. And we'll even check the weight for you in this quick review. So why don't we get started? All right, so as you can see, we got a lot going on on this table. And just so you'll know, we did pick up the Flip 4 Bespoke Edition. This thing is got black accents all around it with this awesome green color that we picked up. And uh, we're liking that so far. It's a nice option when you want something small to throw in your pocket. We did the unboxing and the close-ups. We'll put the link in the description on that one. That's what the image looks like on the video right there, okay? But let's jump in. Let's talk about this case here. So this is an $89.99 case, right? 90 bucks. But keep in mind, it includes a $40 S Pen. This is a um, Fold Edition S Pen. It is a special S Pen. You can't use a regular S Pen on the Fold 4, which we picked up, as you could see, in a similar color, that blue which is nice. So let me go ahead and just throw this on for a minute. And then, like I said, we're also going to do wireless charging test. We're going to do a wireless power share test and we'll weigh it so you could get all that information. Let me go ahead and uh, start off by putting this on in the back. What you want to do is you just want to take the phone and just drop it into the corner. It snaps into place real easy, this type of case, no issues. And let me go ahead and put the front on. Now, keep in mind, the front of the case does have adhesive. It's got a strip here. It's got a strip on the other side, as you can see. And uh, it also has a corner strip, I believe, right up here. So it's got two corner strips. It's actually got four strips. Now, the reason why they did that is these pop off real easy. You know, they go on easy, but they pop off easy. So let's take a look now at this case real quick, and then I'll show you how the kickstand and the S Pen work. Well, actually, let's go ahead and throw in the S Pen. So look at this slot here. You take it, and you push it right in. It locks in place. Really cool. Got easy access to your pen. But if you don't want to use your pen, pop this out. Take your kickstand. Pop that in, and I'll show you the kickstand in a minute. But let's take a look at the case. So if we start at the top, you're going to see here that we have really good coverage when it comes to the microphone. So you can see here, it really, all three microphones are exposed. Your speaker grill is good. Let's look at the uh, bottom. Again, speaker grill, real nice access here for your USB cable, which is cool. Again, our microphone, no problem. We look at the side and everything looks good there. It's totally exposed. So you can get to your biometric and your power button, your volume rocker, no problem at all. Now, the downside to a case like this is it's not gonna give you a lot of protection. So if you look at the cameras, you're gonna see that they're right about almost exposed. I mean, they are slightly under, but if you drop this, you got to be careful. What about lip protection? If you look at the case here, you're going to see that, again, it's kind of like non-existent, really. It's a tiny drop. Now, the reason why it looks better here is as you go into the corner towards the back of the phone, it is raised higher here. But when it comes to the front of the phone, or at least that side, you're not getting a lot here. So just be careful. Obviously your hinge is exposed. So let's check out the kickstand. 
If you open up the kickstand, you obviously have a viewing ability this way, right? It works fine. The second position for the kickstand is when the case is fully open. Now you're able to use your kickstand like that with no issue at all. It holds the weight with no problem whatsoever. So that's pretty cool. That's pretty nice. And if you look at the design here, you've got Samsung logo. This is a one side kickstand. I thought it was a two side, but it's a one side kickstand. And, uh, you know, really nice case. Again, real easy to pop out the kickstand, throw in the S Pen. Why don't we take a minute and check out wireless charging? So as you can see, wireless charging works, right? The red light's on, the wireless charging is working. Why don't we go ahead and check out PowerShare? Wireless PowerShare works with the kickstand on. Will it work if you leave the S Pen on? So I couldn't get it to work with the S Pen on. I had to take it off. It works when the kickstand is in. So just be aware. Before I go ahead and weigh this case, I'm going to pull up an image on the left side of the screen. If you have some time, it's launching in a few days. It's a ton of Fold 4 cases with all of our testing and the timestamps. So look out for that video. I'll try to put it in the description as well of this video. But let's go ahead and check the weight of this case. We're getting 11 ounces with the case and the phone. Well, guys, thank you so much for your time. I really hope this video helped you. This is really a nice case. And don't forget, we'll put a link in the description for our other video that's got tons of cases for the Z Fold 4. Hey, if you like our video and it helped you in some way, give us a thumbs up. That really helps the channel. And by the way, if you're not a subscriber, subscribe to our channel. We'll put our social media up top. But guys, thank you so, so much for hanging with us today. We really appreciate it. Hey guys, take a moment and give us a thumbs up. We'd really appreciate it. As you can see, Brooklyn, she's waving her tail for you. Take a moment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell and you'll get notified of new videos we come out with. Also, follow us and contact us on Instagram, Twitter, or Facebook. We'd love to have you. Thank you so much and have a wonderful day.